We are here in Iowa at the world's largest nickel. wooden nickel. Don, are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. This is where we're going to start our adventure today at the world's largest wooden nickel. Don't tread on me. Vote for common sense. Yeah, pretty cool. We're here at a rest area and I don't let the sleepies get to you. We're here at the Herbert Hoover Presidential Library and Museum. We're going to run in real quick. And That was the Presidential Library. We didn't get a chance to go in because they were just getting ready to close. It's just a quick stop. It wasn't really a planned stop. The presidents started with humble beginnings. There were some that were that were blessed with fortune and became president as well. And finally, we have made it to the world's largest truck stop. Now, wow, the land of make-believe. Bucky's is the world's largest convenience store. Let's head on in there. It's crazy, it's huge. Here we are. We're, we're gonna see it for ourselves. I know a lot of vloggers have been here but this is our time, our turn, right? Yep. Move over Bucky's. Yeah, this is definitely bigger than a Bucky's. Without the beaver. They don't have a beaver here. They don't have brisket sandwiches. I'm, I'm impressed with the beef. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm impressed with the beef. Very, very cool. They got a Taco Bell, a Wendy's, and a Pizza Hut. Oh, wow. They don't have that at a Bucky's, right? And taffy. And they have an arcade. Dairy Queen Coffee and Bagels Pizza Hut. Now the one thing I will say, the bathrooms are not as clean as Bucky's. Not as clean, just saying. Oh my goodness, look at that. There's a truck parked in here. Saw stack, big enough to put your, your hand down into. Very chromey, isn't it? If you were to have a truck, what color would it be? Yellow. Yellow? Like that yellow one over there? And the trucking museum. But there's only 10 minutes left. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to get in there. The museum there, you can walk around. It's by donation. So you can leave a donation. By now, you guys all know we've been back for a long time um, from our trip to America's Heartland. We and what did you think, Don? I really enjoyed Wisconsin. I haven't been there since I was like two years old, so it was nice to be back. America was crazy amazing. I enjoyed the Mall of America. I was really amazed. It was so big and so it had so much to offer in there. You want to talk about underprivileged people? Me. Like, I'm, I'm tickled to death about the gas station with this gas pump in there. <laughs> I had to use a new editing software, and this video here would be created with the new editing software. Um, so. I'm hoping it turned out okay. Big major road trips, but I think we do have a few small road trips coming up. Nothing as big as the one we just had taken. Um, and then next year in 2025, uh, we're going to do some pretty cool traveling. Uh, we got some very ambitious, ambitious plans. I think it's ambitious is the word. We have a lot of ambition for a lot of different type of travel. That's it, guys. Uh, this is a new editing software. I just kind of wanted to put that out there. Uh, like this vlog. Give it a thumbs up. Also, if you haven't, please subscribe to so miss these upcoming road trip adventures. And until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, bye everyone.